first. After two years of anticipation, an iconic Jesus statue has officially been resurrected at Solid Rock Church. Good evening to you. I'm Tricia Mackey. Tonight, community members dedicated that 51-foot sculpture. It has been nicknamed Hug Me Jesus for the outstretched arms that church officials say send a message of welcome to drivers along 75. The former statue known as Touchdown Jesus burned down in June of 2010 after it was hit by lightning. The statue was assembled just over a week ago at the church, but tonight fireworks and music officially welcome the sculpture home. Fox 19's Jennifer Grove is live with community reaction to the new addition at Solid Rock Church. Jennifer? Well, the celebration out here just quieted down not that long ago. I can tell you the official name of this new statue is the Lux Mundi, or the Light of the World. But folks here at the church say whatever people end up calling it, they hope it will stand as a beacon of hope for years to come. The lights that lit up the sky for the dedication were very different than the orange glow seen that June night two years ago. Well, we were devastated, of course, when we first heard that it, that it was on fire. They called us at our house and said the statue's on fire. But from the ashes, the Solid Rock Church has resurrected a new highway side landmark. His arms are outreached to, to reach out to anybody. Even though Tom's wife Barbara just had surgery, they still made it out for the dedication. This means everything to us. This is our church. Piece by piece, the sculpture took its place along I-75. Outstretched arms replace the heaven-headed arms of touchdown Jesus. I think any time that anybody, whether it's an atheist, an agnostic, or whether it's a believer, when they drive by here, they have to think one word, Jesus. While the church was determined to rebuild, they've done what they can to make sure this sculpture will last. From the fire-resistant materials chosen to the lightning rod atop Jesus' head. The other one, we knew that it was very flammable, and this one is supposed to be uh, protected pretty good. But not everyone was celebrating the dedication. Idolaters will not enter into the kingdom of heaven. A group of seven men who wouldn't identify themselves by name stood just off the property, calling the statue an idol. They can believe what they want. We're here because we love them and we're warning them to repent. We're not idolizing this object. Nobody's out here worshiping the object. We're just here to honor Jesus. Now, in an effort to tell all sides of the story, some of our viewers today questioned why not take the money for the statue, put that into the community to some other needs. So we asked the pastor tonight. She says that this statue has been entirely paid for through insurance money from, as you saw that video, the touchdown Jesus, as they called it, that burned two years ago. Reporting live here at Solid Rock Church tonight, Jennifer Grove, Fox.